Standard notation is writing a word using only digits and sometimes commas. Expanded notation is writing that same number as the sum of the values of its digits. 348 is written 3 times 100, which gives us 300, plus 4 times 10, which gives us 40, plus 8 times 1 equals 8. Now there's many ways to write multiplication, and I've chosen to use dots. 300 plus 40 plus 8 equals 348, the same as our standard notation. Now let's work one together. Let's use 62,759. Now our 6 is in the 10 thousands place. So we're going to start with 6 times 10,000 plus 2 times 1,000 plus 7 times 100 plus 5 times 10 plus 9 times 1. If we multiply each part, we get 60,000 plus 2,000 plus 700 plus 50 plus 9. The sum, when you add all these together, is 62,759. Let's work one more. Let's try 28,014. I want to draw your attention to the zero in the middle. Our 2, again, is in the 10 thousands place. So we're going to say 2 times 10,000 plus 8 times 1,000. I don't have any 100s. That's what the zero means. So I'm going to just skip it altogether. I'm going to skip right to my 1, which is in the tens place, and say 1 times 10 plus 4 times 1. This time I'm going to add up the parts. I get 20,000 plus 8,000 plus 10 plus 4. That gives me 28,014.